Why can't YouTube be more like DeviantArt? What do I mean by that? Well, for those of you who don't know this, I also have a DeviantArt and a YouTube account. So, what I like to do is I like the unlimited space I have. Even though I am limited to certain options that premium membership users have. For instance, um, the limitations that I have with a basic account are that I can't have be an administrator of more than three groups. Okay, it's not too bad. Remember when YouTube had groups? I remember that. Why'd they get rid of that? That was awesome. It was like a way of interacting with the community. You could meet new people about your hobbies. You could discuss. I was I used to be a part of a DVD collecting thing, and this was back in 2010 when I was first starting out. I loved it. I started loving the shit out of YouTube. Remember that channel layout they had? That was a shit. Then they had to go and fuck it up. Just Google. Because Uncle Google had to come in and say, Well, YouTube, let's get rid of all this creativity here, all this interactive shit. And let's try to be more on Facebook. Let's get that Google Plus down the fucking throat. Wait, wait, the what? Google Plus, we got one Google Plus. You go keep jamming it in there. Yeah, basically, that's my representation of Google to YouTube. One of the things I love about uh, DeviantArt is that you pretty much have unlimited freedom, you know? They never really seem to skew your uh, watcher count or friend count. They have a friend count. Speaking of which, it's just so fucking annoying. Because I remember when YouTube used to have a friend option. I love the shit out of that option. In fact, I used to favor the friend option more than I did the, did the subscriber option. So when I looked at the friend option, I was like, oh, I got a lot of friends on YouTube. That's great. I loved it. I love the interactivity of the old YouTube. I wish YouTube would go back to this format because it was fucking great. And it was only till recently when I used to have 170 subscribers a few hours ago. I wish I had some fucking screen capture technology on this damn laptop so I could show you what it was before the fucking, you know, drop. And I know why. Because YouTube is doing another fucking spring cleaning. And I know this is for, this is to make sure there's an accurate viewer count for ads. Am I going to have to suck it up? Yes, it's just irritating and I'm gonna sound like a whiny little douchebag but it is unfair okay it seems unfair for me because I have worked pretty hard as a small time guy a very very small time guy to make my channel what it is my own little world of where I post some random politics uh, toy reviews movie reviews DVD updates whatever the fuck I feel like talking about and it's just like so irritating to me when I lose a subscriber, like one or two even, and then it's like, oh my god, just just leave my subscribe. It's just like leave my fucking sub base alone. Just leave it the fuck alone and look at this, okay? Also, if you have a Demon Dart page and you got a giantess fetish, I created this group called Anything Giantess, meaning that uh anything that's a well, it depends on whether I uh I'm going to try to be more specific in a different video about that, but, yeah, there's a group I made called Anything Giantess, so, yeah, I might split this into parts, so this might be part one or the only video I do. Live long and prosper and have a nice day.